a welcome to class. In this class, we are going to be seeing angles as relating to a straight line, a triangle, and some other polygons. So first, we start with angles on a straight line. The sum of angles on a straight line is 180 degrees. Okay, we have a straight line there with four angles. We want to find the value of the angle B. So we add up the four angles together equal to 180. Why? Because the sum of angles in the straight line is 180 degrees. So when we add the three numbers there, we have 108. We subtract 108 from both sides and we discover our B is 72 degrees. Let's see angles in a triangle. Again, the sum of angles in a triangle add up to 180 degrees. That symbol there is for degree. So let's say we have a triangle right there. We want to find the value of angle C. So what we need to do is that we are going to add up the three angles and we equate it to 180. Okay, right there. So 38 plus 5 is 1, 2, 3. So we subtract 1, 2, 3 from both sides. Our angle C is 57 degree. That's the degree symbol there. Okay, so let's see angles in the polygon. First, we start by giving this very important formula the sum of the angles, the interior angles actually, on the n sided polygon is n minus 2 times 180 degrees. The N there stands for number of sides. So triangle has three sides, quadrilateral has four sides, pentagon has five sides, hexagon has six sides, and so on and so forth. So get the other ones. Okay, let's see an example now that has to be polygon. The sum of the interior angles a new angle is what? So First, we have to know how many sides a null angle has. So, a null angle has 9 sides. So, simply we just write our formula, which is n minus 2 times 180 degree. Substitute in the value of 9, and we get 7 times 180, which is 1260 degree. Okay? Let's see another example. How many sides does a polygon have if the sum of its interior angles is 540 degrees. The solution of the sum of interior angle, we are told this one, n minus 2 times 180 degree. So the sum is given to us in this case, which is 540. So we divide both sides by 180, we get 3 equals to n minus 2. We add 2 to both sides, our n is 5. Okay? So right here, as an assessment question. Test your understanding of the video. Thank you.